Good afternoon. Welcome to the Midday Mole for Thursday, the 4th of November. As we read through Paul's letter to Titus, in the third chapter, I was struck by the first two verses. Paul says to Titus, Remind the people to be subject to rulers and authorities, to be obedient, to be ready to do whatever is good, to slander no one, to be peaceable and considerate, and always to be gentle toward everyone. And as I read that, I thought, if people were living like that, it'd make the world such a good place. It'd make society so pleasant. It'd make uh, the community wonderful. We listen to the rulers and authorities and be ready to do whatever is good, which implies that if the ruler is calling us to do things which are not good, and there have been plenty of rulers through history that have done that, as Christians, we, we say we're not prepared to do that. We will still be subject to them, but we won't do what they tell us to do. And if they end up charging us and imprisoning us, that's the cost of being a disciple. But where we can, we work with the authorities and the rulers and the people who are in charge of the society. But then there's a, a, the extension of just saying, how do we live in the community? We are told to slander no one. And in today with social media, and it's so quick to pass on comments and to retweet something and to share something, which ends up being slanderous to the person, misrepresenting them, casting them in a bad light. And as Christians, we, we don't do that. We hold back and we say, no, if something isn't good, if something isn't positive, if something isn't encouraging, should we be sharing it? Or will we be slandering people? Slander no one. Be peaceable and considerate. And there are many uh, people I know that are not considerate but contentious. They are not peaceable. They want their way. And as Christians we're called to be different. To live at peace with everyone where we can. To, to be a presence for peace. And when there's conflict and, and anger and tension to come in and be able to settle things down and to bring peace. Blessed are the peacemakers is what Jesus says. And that's what we're called to be. To be considerate. Put others first. Don't look only to your own interests but to the interests of others. And that is a theme that occurs again and again and again through the, through the New Testament. And always be gentle toward everyone. Because that's how God deals with us. God is gentle with us. He is compassionate and kind. And so as we live like him, we will be treating people in the same way. So this is a real challenge to us in the modern world. To live differently to the world around us. But to make a difference as we do that. So be challenged with that. And pray that more people would live like that. Pray that Christians will live like this because this, Christians living in this way, will commend the gospel to the world. Be challenged, uh, be encouraged, and be blessed.